Welcome back to the channel everyone. So good to see you again. I know you've all missed me, since I haven't posted for a couple of days. Well, I had some laryngitis, and had to get some more cough lozenges. Anyways, this is just a quick video update to let you know what's happening. It seems Bull and Bankrupt has taken a break from uploading to actively try and get my channel torpedoed and also bury all evidence. And in another recent development, it appears Bald has apparently convinced Rushvi to completely nuke the sections on travel and game where his posts appeared. The timing is suspicious, happening less than a week since my videos started appearing, linking Bald to the forum. And exactly one day after Bald and Bankrupt filed the false privacy claim to block and censor my video on him and his links to the forum. It seems a really odd time for Rush to implement such an unprecedented structural change to his website too, as he is currently very busy on a countrywide tour across the whole expanse of the USA. It seems a bit strange that at this time, possibly the busiest Rush has been for years, that he would take time out of a grilling cross-country schedule and extensive travel to completely overhaul the look of his website and completely wipe the two most popular sections without any warning. Roosh mentioned in a recent video how tired and beat up he was, and that if he hadn't already pre-booked the remaining legs of his tour, that he would stop at this point from fatigue. So despite this overwhelming workload, we're to believe that he will take time out to administer the biggest structural changes in the website's history. It doesn't seem likely, without external factors influencing him. One interesting factor is the website has been declining in earnings. Roosh probably pulls in less than $1,000 a month from the website at present. Contrast this with Bald and Bankrupt's earnings of 40 to 60 k a month from his YouTube videos alone. You can see how there would be room for palms to be greased. Bald and Roosh are also known to each other as well so Roosh could be also doing it to help an ally. Some will point to Roosh's much publicized so-called newfound Christianity and reawakening. I'm not convinced. His so-called turning of a new leaf happened over a year ago, and it just seems mighty odd it took until this exact moment for him to quickly annihilate those parts of his forum. The timing just so happens to perfectly coincide with a big YouTuber with over a million subscribers being linked to those exact sections. You may say it was to allow forum members to save information. This would be plausible except for the fact there was no warning at all given by Roosh. It literally happened overnight. Anyways. What do you think? Am I a conspiracy theorist and this is all a massive quinky dink? Or is my speculation dead on the money? Feel free to leave your thoughts in the comments below. Also, I would encourage you all to upload mirrors of my videos on your channels if you are able, or do some reactions to the videos, or make your own spin on these stories. It's a good precaution in case this channel gets nuked. And a big shout out to Christina Indus who has re-uploaded one of my videos already. Also thanks to all the new subscribers. Make sure to subscribe to hear the latest happenings on Bald and what he does not want you to know about his secret past. And if you have video suggestions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thanks for dropping by guys. J Bold Key, for now.